Hi there, so today I wanted to do a video about my schedule planning for the next semester in university. First, I want to talk about why planning is important for me and also why it could be important for you. Then I want to talk about how I'm planning my new semester, where do I do it, do it on the computer or do I do notes on the paper. And then I say what else I do for planning, then I'll give you a, a little preview for the next videos to come because this will be a little serious about my uni preparations. So let's get started. So now I want to talk about why planning is so important and how it helped me the last semesters. First I want to mention a plan like this or schedule that you have per week gives you a, a routine. Our human bodies are made for routines. The body will get used to it. It's also very important to have a routine so you can take breaks in between the working hours and it's important that you plan your breaks. And then for me it's also important or what I noticed throughout the semester, it really helps against the stress in my head and the thinking about what I have to do and what is coming up like exams, deadlines. If I'm writing down on paper or on my computer, I will get it out of my head so I don't have to think about it anymore. I will just know I have it on my paper, I have it in my agenda or I have it on my computer. There is no way I will forget about it so I don't have to think about it the whole time. It also helps again procrastination because you actually have goals to do on this day and it's not too much. It doesn't seem like a whole bunch of work because you have little goals every day which you can follow and then it's easier to not procrastinate. Then one important thing that our professors also mentioned a lot is more planning goes with more free time. So if you plan ahead you will also notice that you have a lot more free time because you are planning your free time and you are planning your working hours. I could just relax on the weekends and for me the weekends are really for relaxing and self-care and like reset so you can start with fresh energy on Monday. So then I want to talk about schedule planning, like how I do it. The first question is where? So where do I plan? I mostly plan it on Notion. If you don't know about Notion, there are a lot of helpful videos about it on YouTube. It's just basically a note program where you can like have your notes in one place. Sometimes I also like to do it on paper. What I also do beside Notion, I also use an agenda, the one from Muji. I really like the agenda and I want to buy one for the next semester too. There's like one side where you have your weekdays and there's one side, just a free page where you can write anything you want. And I really like keeping track of my goals per week and that is a perfect place to do it. The next question is what I plan in my schedule, like what do I put in my schedule? The first thing I put in my schedule or the, like, the important thing is my lectures. I also like to keep track of my sport activities, like I go to the gym and I do writing, otherwise I don't do it. So I really like to keep that in my schedule. I also wanted to start the next semester with practicing more guitar and then I also do tutoring, then I also put YouTube in it. The last question is about how I'm doing it. So I really like to do it minimalistic and with big blocks like big time blocks because I don't like detailed plans because there's no flexibility and where I can say mm, maybe tomorrow I don't want to do YouTube, I really want to do guitar or I want to go riding. So then we come to the last part, what else do I do? For me it also really helps writing down deadlines and exams because then I know I've written them down, I don't have to think about it anymore. Then I also like to do a per week to-do list. I also mentioned that when I talked about the agenda. I mostly have per week to-do from the professors, like they write down which chapter I have to read for the lecture this week. For every subject I have a week to-do. Then I also like to do a to-do list 
before the day begins because as I talked about it I have a very flexible and minimalistic schedule so the day before I mostly know what I'm really going to do the next day and then what I also mentioned is and what I really want to mention at the end right now my tip is to really plan your self-care like I planned it on the weekend but you can also plan it like on the evenings or I don't know in the morning you really have your self-care time where you can just chill and not think about university at all so then I want to mention what series I'm going to do on my youtube channel so this video is also a part of this series it's uni preparations today we looked at the schedule how i'm planning my schedule i will also do a video about how i learn throughout the semester and i do a self-care video i also plan to do my setup as you saw in the video it's not that organized my setup it's really messy right now and i have to buy a new macbook because mine is broken I'm planning on doing that soon because the semester starts soon so I would really like if you subscribe to my channel if you're interested in the next videos and also give a thumb up if you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching.